What was the name of the character played by Dustin Diamond on the show Saved by the Bell? Screech. What is the capital of Ohio? Columbus. Name one of the two drinks that Marty McFly unsuccessfully tried to order in the 1985 movie Back to the Future. Coca-Cola. What was the title song, I'm sorry, what was the title of the song written by Prince, which became a number one hit for Sinead O'Connor in 1990? Purple Rain. What type of tree grows acorns? A maple. Time. Jeremy, how did you do? No idea. Okay. No idea. All right. Well, that's a, not a great start. We've had worse. Sometimes people are sure they've done terrible. Yeah, true. Let us welcome Hot Wings back in. Yep. Hot Wings that walks turns. back in. Didn't take his thinking coffee today. That might be a factor. Oh, no. no. Oh. I couldn't. I had made coffee, and I realized I hadn't gotten it yet from Rachel's booth and i didn't want to go in there for fear of hearing something yep so all right so yeah i'm a little i'm a little thrown off he's already got something to blame everybody you got your pen though i do have my pen yeah i mean that's all that matters right now because i won't hold my coffee while i think right all right hot wings your turn five hundred dollars on the line for jeremy the metal detectorist your turn begins in three two one what was the name of the character played by dustin diamond on the show saved by the bell screech what is the capital of ohio Columbus. Name one of the two drinks that Marty McFly unsuccessfully tried to order in the 1985 movie Back to the Future. Oh, a uh, Diet Pepsi. What was the title of the song written by Prince, which became a number one hit for Sinead O'Connor in 1990? Nothing compares to you. What type of tree grows acorns? An oak. Time. How'd you do? I got four or five. I screwed up the Marty McFly one. Well, don't give away everything, showbiz. <laughs> well, you asked. Uh, vague terms. Why does everybody give me 100% of the answer I don't need today? <laughs> All right, Hot Wings. All right, Jeremy, welcome back. Thank you. Jeremy's answer when I said, how did you do? He said, I have literally no idea. So, All right. Uh, what was the name of the character played by Dustin Diamond on the show Saved by the Bell? Howie said Screech. Jeremy said Screech. Both correct. One to one. What is the capital of Ohio? You both said Columbus. You are both correct. Two to two. Name one of the two drinks that Marty McFly unsuccessfully tried to order in the cafe in 1985 in the movie Back to the Future. Tom. Howie said Diet Pepsi. Mm. Jeremy said Coke. Oh, you screwed it up too, stupid. He asked for a tab. A tab. And they said, we don't yeah. even have those. And then he said, all right, give me a Pepsi free, which was a kind of Pepsi at the time. Yeah. So Didn't tab. have caffeine. You haven't ordered anything yet. How can I give you a tab? Both incorrect. Two to two. Oh, <laughs> boy. I got lucky on that one. What was the title of the song written by Prince, which became a number one hit for Sinead O'Connor in 1990? Hot Wings said, nothing compares to you. Jeremy went with Purple Rain. Not a big hit for Sinead O'Connor, but it did well for Prince. Hot Wings is correct, three to two. What type of tree grows acorns? Hot Wings sneered and said, oak trees. Did I? Jeremy I said, maple? No, that's the syrup tree. Hot Wings is correct, four to two he wins. I'm a little bit worried on that one. Worry? Well... Yeah, I was worried that Jeremy would get the same number or more than I did because I only got four, and I think I should have gotten five. Oh, I thought you were... Sorry. I thought you were saying those questions were hard. No. Well, they're, they're no, I don't think they were particularly online hard. online saying they're easy. They are well, easy. Well, I mean, they weren't the hardest questions I've ever had. And they were easy. The dude got two. I Well, I, I mean, I think they were reasonably easy today. Well, they were but, definitely but, easy for hot wings. But well, I would have... I mean, well, we could have Kelly well, write I them. I can't say what I would have done. You Impossible don't, questions. Uh, yeah, you don't want me to write your trivia questions. Remember what happened the last time I did that free beer? Yeah, I got zero because your <laughs> questions were too hard. I mean, so. Yeah, My I, questions are too hard. I, well, actually, no, they are too hard. I it's too like hard for it free when beer. you come up with the questions for free beer. I know that. I bet I, you I, I can come up with questions it. that you couldn't answer either, Hot Wings. I doubt it. I would never want yours. <laughs> I would not want <laughs> yours either. <laughs> Why wouldn't y'all want my 
question. Your questions, questions are, too are hard. often hard. Most of the things That's you the do point are of trivia. too hard. Even your lists during paired with an idiot yeah. are too oh, wait, hard. So yeah. now you're gonna now you're going. Oh yeah, her list paired with an idiot. <laughs> it's like purple uh, three legged para- octopus. Yeah, yellow paramecium. <laughs> I'm sorry. The last time we played paired with an idiot, I believe I came in third. Wow, out of five. <laughs> <laughs> do just- you make the playoffs for that? <laughs> I'm just saying, like, I, you know, you do trivia fine. I just think that I could do better Thanks. questions. You do trivia fine. You're fine. <laughs> Why do you fine. think I write them for you when I'm going to be gone? I send you the sheet. Because mine are too hard. Yes. I make ones that you guys couldn't answer. So uh-huh. now, well, Wait, well, so you're... So you're what? You're rope doping this. So now your skill is writing questions that are impossible to answer for a trivia game. That's the point of trivia. To make them impossible. To yeah. make them impo- No, it's like a fine, like a fine, a fine balance. It's a fine balance. Yeah. yeah, you want to like bonk it off the guardrail here and there, maybe. But well, we play two different types of trivia, I guess. Well, I would like the opposite of yeah. yours on <laughs> Fridays. <please. laughs> I could definitely come up with questions that y'all don't, y'all couldn't answer. And now Kelly Cheese presents ninety seconds of silence. <laughs> Pass. <laughs> I mean, You'll never of, get this. All of my answers are, are usually questions. Yeah. Like, I yeah. think yours are. Everything, everything yeah, with yeah. an up inflection. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you A often seven? answer questions with questions. Oh. <laughs> derp, derp, derp. <laughs>